Welcome to this channel. In today's video, we will explore a strategic scenario that is rarely discussed in detail. How the B-2 Spirit Stealth Bomber of the United States could carry out an air operation against Iran's nuclear facilities. We'll break it down into four segments, covering the aircraft's technology, strategic targets, method of attack, and the potential global impact. Watch this video until the end to get a complete overview. The B-2 Spirit is a strategic stealth bomber operated by the US Air Force, designed to penetrate enemy air defenses and conduct long-range missions undetected. With its flying wing design and radar-absorbent coating, the B-2 is nearly invisible to conventional radar systems. It has a range of over 11,000 kilometers, supported by aerial refueling. One of its key strengths is its ability to carry the GBU-57AB Massive Ordnance Penetrator, a bunker-busting bomb weighing over 13 tons, highly suitable for targeting underground nuclear facilities. Equipped with satellite navigation, electronic warfare tools, and precision-guided weapon systems, the B-2 is capable of carrying out critical missions in high-risk zones. Iran has several major nuclear facilities located across strategic locations, some of which are heavily fortified against airstrikes. Fordo, built under a mountain and highly protected. Natanz, the largest uranium enrichment site in Iran. Iraq reactor, related to heavy water production. Isfahan, used for uranium conversion and processing. These facilities are heavily monitored and guarded with air defense systems, including medium-range missiles, radar, and underground bunkers. Each target presents unique challenges. That's why only an aircraft like the B-2 combining stealth with powerful strike capabilities could potentially reach and neutralize them in a precise, single mission strike. If a B-2 strike mission were to take place, it would likely launch from bases such as Whiteman, AFB in Missouri, or Diego Garcia in the Indian Ocean, depending on operational strategy. The B-2 would fly at night, maintaining a low profile to avoid radar detection. During the mission, it would be supported by tanker aircraft for aerial refueling. As it approaches the target, the B-2 would release a bunker-penetrating bomb directly over the underground facility. The strike would be carried out swiftly, in a highly coordinated manner, and supported by satellite intelligence and reconnaissance drones. The entire operation would be executed with minimal radio communication, no open signals, and completed in a short time frame before returning to base. Such a mission is designed to be surprising, limit escalation, and minimize civilian casualties. A strike on Iran's nuclear facilities would have major political, economic, and military consequences. Iran could respond by activating its proxy networks across the Middle East or targeting foreign interests in the region. Major powers like Russia and China would likely issue strong condemnations and push for diplomatic resolutions. Gulf countries and Israel might quietly support the move while boosting their own defenses. The economic impact would also be significant. Tensions in the Strait of Hormuz could trigger a spike in global oil prices, as a large portion of the world's oil supply passes through that route. On the diplomatic front, the United Nations and organizations like the IAEA would likely call for investigations and mediation to prevent the conflict from escalating further. 
That's a complete overview of how the US B-2 Spirit could be used in a strategic mission to strike Iran's nuclear facilities. This scenario goes far beyond air power. It involves strategic calculations, global diplomacy, and long-term impacts on world stability. If this video helped expand your insight, feel free to like, subscribe, and share for more strategic analysis content. See you in the next video.